Namaste Soul Tribe Spiritual Healer back to give you guys a message. Hi Fire Signs, this is going to be your reading, Aries Leo Sagittarius. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all your um, prayers, um, all your uh, healing wishes, and all your comments on my post that um, I was in the hospital for my kidneys, guys, and that was the most excruciating pain I have ever felt. Okay, but um, I have been resting for several days. I have been taking my medications, and um, I think I'm feeling up to uh, coming back and doing readings again. So I think it was because of all your prayers that I'm actually sitting here with you guys right now. So I love you, and thank you so much for all your prayers, guys. It has been um, a blessing, okay? I picked some cards. I pulled some cards from the um, Energy Oracle. Just to see what the main energy for this message for you guys, for the weekend energy. Okay, in your life, um, somebody could be 44 years old here. But there's a woman holding a heart, okay? And then um, there's the door to value, okay? So I feel like you guys are starting to, like, walk to, into the door to value, self-love and value. You guys are um, seeing a new perspective. 31 is here, too. Somebody could be 31, Somebody could be 45, 52, 27, or 25. Yeah, those are the um, numbers on these cards, guys. Okay, but I feel like a lot of you guys need to rest and rejuvenate your energy. Pull back from a situation here because you guys are starting to love yourself and hold on to your heart very closely, protecting your heart. Okay, because you're entering the door to value, so you're about to become successful. Or you're already successful, but you're about to enter the door to value, which means you're about to get an amazing opportunity that's going to bring you a sudden opportunity with a lot of money involved, okay? So you guys are about to have this opportunity handed to you by the divine, an opportunity of a lifetime, guys. You cannot, you cannot turn this opportunity down, okay? And this is being given to you because you chose to withhold energy, you chose to work on yourself, you chose to tap into your higher selves, and you chose to... Um, Use another perspective in your life, which means like you guys started to love yourselves, truly accept yourselves, truly know that you are not meant for everybody, okay? So pulling back your energy, holding on to your energy is bringing you the door to value because some of you guys are choosing to walk away from a situation that's not working out, okay? When it comes to a man holding a heart, okay, you could be connected to a masculine that has been holding on to you, but he needs to walk away. And this masculine might be finally walking away from someone because things aren't working out. And this person can't seem to let go of you. Okay? And this person sees you over here loving yourself, going to the door and to the door to value, right? So now this person wants to come towards you and work on a caring connection. But there's a karmic that's envious and deceitful and is trying to keep this person in the limbo. Or there's somebody behind the scenes that's trying to manipulate the energies with the moon. Oh, yeah, some of you guys might have felt this energy heavy over the um, past couple days. It really took a toll on me as well. I actually ended up in the hospital sick. So this full moon, um, there was a lot of people harnessing the full moon energy, not for so much good. You understand? There was a lot of people out here doing um, moon magic out here. And um, especially these karmics that already know that there's a caring connection that's meant to come together because the woman holding the heart... And the man holding the heart here, this is a couple. This is a divine couple here. So this union was meant to happen, okay? So you don't need to worry. Just rest and rejuvenate because the divine is bringing this situation together because you guys do have goddess energy. You guys are the goddess of the moon. You guys can um, harness the full moon energy and um, manifest whatever it is that you want. Make sure if you're manifesting with the full moon, you have good intentions because I'm not going to recommend that you... Harness the full moon energy for anything else than good intentions, okay? Because that will backfire on you guys. Let me see what's going on here for the Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I just feel like some of you guys are just fed up and walking away from a situation that's no longer serving you. Some of you guys are thinking about relocating. Um, you need a new environment. You need a new scenery. Everything is almost like played out when it comes to family. You're fed up with these people. So you need to go retreat. Maybe you need to take a trip, a, a little vacation or a little getaway by yourselves or, you know, with somebody that you actually trust, that you actually could let um, 
let your mind relax free your mind from anything that's been going on behind the scenes because you guys don't need to control anything things are being controlled by the divine things are going in your favor things are going as they're supposed to guys you guys are attracting love messages of love here you go some of you guys are getting messages of love from your person okay and this person is willing to travel to see you okay someone's gonna travel to see you guys messages of love coming through yes your psychic gifts are increasing you guys have an intuition that someone's coming towards you. you you could just feel this person's energy okay and when it comes to hidden documents and a crooked lawyer this person will be getting exposed because there's documents that are going to prove something here some of you guys might be having dizzy spells or um stomach pains at this time divine feminine you got to protect your sacral chakra you got to protect your solar plexus that's what ancestor told me before i started recording all of us all divine feminines we should be doing um sacral chakra meditations and solar plexus chakra meditations okay because there's a lot of envy there's a lot of jealous eyes there's a lot of evil eyes on you divine feminine because you guys are transforming rapidly okay and your masculines are too okay the masculines are too okay so there's a brother here okay something's going on with one of your brothers someone's brother here can be getting caught up or wrapped up in the justice system because somehow this brother tried to manipulate something in your life here to not go in your favor or this brother could have worked with other people as well in the family to betray you guys your money is going to be increasing tenfold okay like i said somebody wants to come and propose or take you on a getaway romantic getaway somebody's traveling in because you guys are choosing to walk away from a connection that no longer serves you so that's bringing in something new right so here goes the witches and the warlocks always coming out like i said they've been using the full moon energy and this is um whatever you guys had to go through recently in energy you guys have defeated that just like i defeated that guys you know we're warriors here so now they're gonna have to deal with the consequences of that energy they used during the full moon okay so get ready for that guys because you're gonna start to hear about these towers around you divine feminine you are being gifted you are uh psychically like really psychically in tune right now very psychic at this time divine feminine you have a new business offer here okay so some of you guys are having a new opportunity in business for some of you guys you might be getting a promotion at your actual company or some a company that you've been wanting to work with is going to actually reach out and they're going to give you this opportunity okay somebody's stepping down from a position and you and for some of you guys you will be stepping into that position and that's not for everyone some of you guys actually starting your own businesses so congratulations to you my loves because you guys are exploring your talents you guys are in your confidence you guys are not looking back okay you're not letting anything hold you back energetically you guys are doing the work and for some of you guys that you keep going back and forth in your head about these past people Please do a meditation. I did a two-hour meditation today, guys, just so I could feel good enough to come on this video because I really missed you guys. I really missed talking to you guys the most, okay? And I really wanted to remind you guys to don't get stuck in your head. A personal issue will be, re um, will be reaching a resolution, okay? God is bringing your loved ones together, and you guys are protected, okay? But there's mainly, there's, an, there's like a cancer energy. You guys could be dealing with this cancer energy but if you had an issue with a cancer um this person might come through they might apologize they might want to like reach a resolution to this situation some of you guys are waiting for a financial payment is coming it's coming in like this week this upcoming week some of you guys are going to be getting a payment released into your bank account that you've been waiting on for a while now it's been taking so long have faith in your dreams because your dreams are manifesting at this time my beautiful fire signs and believe in the impossible because um Something with the full moon energy has shifted. Okay, the full moon that just happened, I think it was called the strawberry full moon. Very powerful, guys. I mean, like, literally, that that moon, like, affected my whole kidney system, okay? So believe in the impossible because the impossible is going to happen. Something that you thought was impossible is actually going to come through for you guys. You've been manifesting this. Yep, and your emotions could be running high, but this has, this could have to do with a new career. This could have to do with a move that you were afraid to make this move, but you're going to take that leap of faith. So you're going to believe in the impossible, and you need to temper those emotions because you're worrying for no reason, guys. Look at the bigger picture. Look at the bigger picture. You guys are actually blessed. You guys are actually protected. 
you guys are actually headed for prosperity that lies right ahead. So you could be dealing with a Taurus, but you guys are learning to surrender. Surrendering to the divine, letting go of your worries and fears. You are so close to achieving your goal, fire signs. Okay, so don't look back, move forward. Moving forward is, is the only way that you are going to win, guys. Okay? I'm not going to make this video too long. As I already told you guys, I'm still trying to gain my strength back. It was not easy. I'm still on medication. So during this video, I'm a little woozy in and out. Okay, off and on, I'm a little woozy. I didn't eat nothing. I was like fasting for like three days. So today I finally put some chicken soup in my stomach, some chicken broth and soup. Okay, so sudden wealth here, guys. Um, sudden wealth, that's what I'm saying. You guys are headed for sudden wealth. You could be seeing the number 11 a lot. 1111, being aligned with your true um, life purpose. Okay, because something's being decided in the courthouse. You guys might receive this financial payment or windfall. You've been on this journey for a long time, guys. Finally, you're reaping your good karma. 1010 energy. Okay. Yeah, because there's these false people. These false people have to go to court, okay? So you guys might be suing some people that were false, and you're going to receive sudden wealth from this. You're going to be victorious in the situation. If some of you guys don't know about this happening, you will. You will be notified. You might get a letter, an important letter in the mail from this. Something has um, been done behind the scenes. A mature woman. This mature lady, it's like an older, elder woman in your family. Um, might be sick or ill. You guys might need to check on this elder in your family. This elder might be sick or ill. Okay. Um, I, I'm getting the energy of somebody that's going to... Okay, gosh. I got this. I got a channel message, so I'm going to have to tell you this. There's a, a female that's going to be sick or ill, and this is an elder. Okay. And this elder is, like, going to be, like, on her, um, how do you call that? Like, hospice. Like, when somebody has only a certain amount of time left to live. This woman's going to confess something to you guys, and this is not for everybody. But some of you guys, if you know there's an elder that's very ill, this elder's going to confess something to you before she passes away. You are the main female, or you're dealing with a main female here. Yes, toil and labor. Working all hard. You guys have been working so hard, it's time to take a little break and rest and rejuvenate. Because your wishes are about to manifest. You're not going to have to work hard. You're going to have long-term wealth and success and stability. You're getting a message from someone that loves you, and they're going to reach out, okay? They're going to reach out. Mature man. A mature man might be reaching out to apologize to you for something. This could be an elder man in your family, okay? Someone's bringing you a gift, or someone's leaving you a gift because this person might be passing, or they just want to bring you a peace offering, okay? Marriage. There's going to be a marriage that might be ending, okay? And someone's having bad health. I already said that. This mature woman or a mature man might be having bad health, guys, okay? So that keep that in mind. Woo! The pathway is that you guys are being guided to the right path, okay? You guys are. I heard Charlie. I heard Charles. I heard um, Jenna or Janet. I heard Steve or Steven. Somebody's in their thoughts about you, okay? I also heard Jessica, Jason. I heard Janine or Jarrell, message of concern, okay? I heard Leroy, definitely I heard Leroy. Somebody's name might be Lee or Roy or Leroy, okay? Distant horizons, okay? In the distant horizon, something's coming and you guys are going to get a message of concern. But you guys are kind of having an expectation about your ship coming right in. Your ship's about to come right in, okay? But first you're going to have a message of concern. Because somebody's ill around you, okay? And this person is really in their thoughts about you because you, they walked away or they didn't choose you or they chose someone else over you. And now they see you with all these blessings coming towards you. And I don't know, it feels like this person's regretful or now they want to come and ask you, uh, give you an actual proposal here. Wow, yeah, somebody's really having bad health, guys. Okay? And these are the messages that I'm getting for your reading, guys. I already told you guys this wasn't going to be a long message, but um, I just wanted to test out my strength on this video and let you guys know I'm thinking about you guys. I'm sorry. I had to take the time to heal. Thank you so much for being patient with me, guys. I'm open for um, personal readings again. If you guys need a personal, just reach out to me down below. I will be happy to guide you guys and give you the clarity.
Wow, you guys are coming into a new partnership and alliance. I'm telling you, you're going to have this major opportunity. Someone wants to reach out and work together with you. And this is going to end up being a spiritual connection, spiritual union that's coming toward you. This is a love of a lifetime, guys, an opportunity of a lifetime. Okay. Triumph and success, you're headed for success, guys, and you had to make a certain amount of sacrifices to get here, but somebody also is making sacrifices and walking away from no longer serves them because someone's having memories of love with you, and this person wants to come to have a spiritual union, so look out for that. Your person's going to reach out and make contact, and want they want union, okay? These, this, these people that you, these divine masculines are being awakened, divine feminines watching this video, the divine masculines are being awakened. Divine Masculine is watching this video. You guys are awakening to who your soulmate is. So make a move, okay? Reach out to your Divine Feminine if you haven't done that. So just do it because this union is meant to happen, okay? And everything that you guys have been waiting on, all the communication, all the actual proof, all the paperwork or documents or the payout, it's coming. Your opportunity is here. It is, this is your season to benefit and reap your rewards for all your hard work, my loves. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video. Till the next time, I love you guys. Namaste.